Alright, All right, guys, what is up? Welcome back. Racing with Borderless Blitzes tournament. Today we have EDSS versus Lathel. I feel, how do you pronounce that? I always forget. But, anyways, we're seeing a quick 0001 here. Oh, that's an unfortunate Q from Lathel. Yeah, it's gonna be both quickly ending out of uh, on <clears throat> here. We are gonna be seeing quick matches here. Now, you were watching the last match, you missed it. That was Sphinx 2 0, the last match. And now we are on to the EDSS, which is the yeah. last one here. Please move quickly to the chamber lock as the effects of prolonged exposure to the... Uh, EDSS is going to be making their way towards the elevator now. Laffle is a little bit behind. Sure, I'm pronouncing it wrong. I'm sorry. I know you're molding for the other side of the mic. Uh, we're going into O2 now here, though. Both of them. Quick in. And I'm just gonna be waiting here, level getting up on that on that door. Let's see, he's gonna grab the portal bit now. A little bit behind. Uh, flame out. Super boil shots. Radius S. Gonna go into 04. Wrath will also gonna be hitting these portal shots. Get it quickly into 04. The 05 here now. We're going through ADSS, finishing up 05. Laugh will how to grab these cubes, finish up 05 as well. Ooh, that cube fell off, that's unfortunate. Now, this is going to be going into the next map, 417. Ooh, overhead from EDSS. Very nicely done. And going into 07, let's see. 06 for laugh or EDSS going into 07. Overhead for Laffle. Oh, EDSS goes for the nice advanced one. Laffle picks up a six. Now we're going to be seeing 08 from EDSS. Nice advanced 07 from Laffle. Unfortunately, it doesn't work out the first time. The advanced 07 is a very fun strat. I love watching it. it. Looks very nice. And there it goes. And ADSS gets clean 08. Back it up. See, so ADSS going for 09 here, and Life will go for 08. Uh, 
the player is going to quick, quickly run through those. Very little issue here. Hello again. To reiterate. Previous one. Yes, that's going to be hitting 10. Oh, we're going to be hitting out 9 here. Let's see. Apparently 10 has been causing people problems today. But not for EDSS. Let's see how this continues to go. EDSS going for this dolphin here. Doesn't seem to work. I'm gonna go for a second try. We'll take a couple tries on dolphin while we'll Baffle is still here in 10. I've noticed that uh, EDSS has. Really fast load time, which is causing this incredible gap. But ESS is going to be hitting Dolphin here. Might as well make it into 11. Oh, let's see. ESS is going into 12, level in 11. Grab the portal gun. I'm gonna quickly make it to the elevator. Oh, let's see, let's see. A nice low flame, let's see, keep throw. And that looks good, but it doesn't land on oh, ADSS, that's unfortunate. Sometimes you don't get the right cube side. Yep, there's cube side adjustment here. And there we go, that was the issue. ADSS picks up the right cube side and gets a third try. Laffle, I'm gonna be going for this fling here. Let's see, low fling. Very nice low fling from Laffle. Gonna be a cube throw. Ooh, almost is a, almost on the cube throw. But going again. Uh, this is unfortunate. From EDSS is 13. That's a little bit unfortunate as well. EDSS entered 14 at a 13 at a round of 44. So let's see what Laffle enters here. going to be 807, so that means EDSS entering had about 25 second lead. However, there was a little bit of a time loss to EDSS here in 13, but that could change as we go into the next map. So 26 versus 33. So that means there's seven seconds, and EDSS fortunately made a couple mistakes with their 14. The nerves must be real here. Lathal also making a couple mistakes, so. Let's see. And this is only the first match, so this could be a lot to see here in the, in the later parts. EDSS now getting the first cycle. See a nice flank from EDSS. Now let's see Laffel going for his first cycle. Let's see, oh, it's gonna work for Laffel. You see a nice fling here. Oh, the fling's not gonna work. A little save here. Go for it again. Uh, this fling, a little tricky, but Laffel ends up getting it. EDSS going into the next map now, 16. Uh, and the Elathal just finishing up 15 now. A little bit of junk cam, but it still works. The Enrichment Center apologizes for the inconvenience and wishes you the best of luck. Yeah, it says, let's see, also the race of the Spider Man. Elathal is getting ready for it as well. And uh, EDSS. Already finished with 16, gone in the blink of an eye. And now that's the number starting up 16. We'll see here. Let's see the Spider Man. We'll start off the races with this one. Let's finish out 16. Oh no, I thought I was going to die. Fortunately, let's see. The SS is going to be going into 17 now. You can see Laffle 
Entering the exit elevator here. Video says, can we go for Cholino Flynn here? I'm not sure how much we've seen it so far, but we haven't seen the last match. Seeing in this match it's very nice. And it looks like it's going to be, oh, just barely. Let's see, yeah, let's go for it one more time. And it's not. Unfortunate. that Laffel getting a little bit of time to catch up here. And there we go, it just says, getting the Cholino fling. Now Laffel climbing the stairs down the hallway. That's a scary aura, but it's going to keep Laffel alive for now. And unfortunately, I spoke too soon, that orb is going to get Laffel. But, oh no, they dropped the cube. This isn't, no slaw. You can't. Or inbounds, I mean. Oh, we're going to be seeing another Cholino play. That is incredibly cool. Love to see the Cholino play that's coming through. Alright, and last one, it's a first try. Doesn't grab the cube. Gonna go and grab it again. Still not that bad of a, of a uh, job here. We'll be seeing eight tunes. EBSS. Looking like they're trying to correct something here. Oh, they're gonna go for a falling shot. And they're gonna hit it. That's insane, a falling shot. Oh, they missed. Oh, they hit it twice in a row. And now Lathel's gonna be going with the 18. You see VSS going for impossible strafe. Or some variation. I don't know. They're all, there's so many of them. Let's see Lathel now grabbing the camera. And please attend an enrichment center. Going into 19 for our ADSS. Eighteen last let's see how these reportals go. Right, no reportals and last one, it seems. Ooh, good at safe stats. Don't want to be messing up here. And there we go, last we'll be finishing up 18 ADSS. All the now the is going to go into the end of 19 and the last one that will end the 19. What are you It's incredibly tough. I'm going to catch the time and get to end here. EDSS, top 10 Wilson Surrounded by the way. So, it is a monumental feat to have to go up against at this point. I mean, you're talking about serious, serious grind. One of the best. We we'll see McKills going for EDSS. Gonna try a couple of McKills here. And Raffle going down now into the tube. EDSS is going to be loading in the EO1 in the 1409. Well, Lathal is going to be the entirety of EO0 behind. Uh, you don't need to see another good it goes Yana coming here. Good people, don't stand up. Can you hear me? This is your fault. It didn't happen. EDSS is going to be finishing up EO1 here. Now, you know, you know, two started at 2.46. Laffle is just a map behind at this point. Well, oh, EDSS, can we start in a boss fight?
Because despite your violent behavior, the only thing you should have to do so is like a low or mid 16 from the EDSS here, that, I believe. Maybe we'll just call it a day. I guess we both know that isn't going to happen. You chose this path. Now the EDSS PB being a 1536. You. Couldn't find the laugh of PB. Not on SOC yet. I'll we'll have to ask you after. Where are you taking? You're kidding me. Did you oh, just EDSS, purple core optimization. Now time for EDSS to stare at a wall for a bit, Lapple. Going for Flippy Skippy here. Flippy Skippy, a very fun, very annoying trick. Fun to do when it works, annoying when it doesn't work. But that's just about all of speedrunning, to be honest. But Lapple's gonna make it work, though. We're just gonna need to go back for a quick round trip to grab the turret. Uh, it looks like that's right, it's gonna get the best of Laffle for now. So get comfortable while I warm up the Let's see, well, Laffle's in a good setup to grab the turret. There we go, Laffle has the turret now. Finishing out EO1 here. Trust me, it'll be a lot less painful. Rocket in the glass. You think you're doing some damage? Too fast, Jewish. Uh, let's see those great little vent jump. Perfect from Lapple. Well, yeah. Let's grab on the blue core. Go for the blue core up. We were talking about it last time. The blue core up is very hard. Media is just hitting her. This shows the testament to their skill, really. Lapple, looks like they have the load of save to go back here and do the vent jump again. Well, unfortunate. They seem to be entering the portal too. High and they're hitting the they top. seem they're to be entering the portal too high and they're hitting the top. They're not getting enough height. It looks like they probably want to shoot the portal farther ahead of them. It looks like they've got it. It looks like they probably want to shoot EDSS. the portal farther ahead of them. It looks done. like they've got it. Now EDSS done. 1654. Low high 1654. Need to be 1654. Just entering EO2. High 1654. We'll see Lathel just entering EO2. It's gonna be some. This shot here it's gonna be very annoying some, shot. The bane of this many shot players here, existence. Very annoying shot. The bane of many players. Walking over EO2 here. Portaling over. I'm gonna be rocking over. Walking over EO2 here. Portaling over. Entering the boss room here. I'm gonna say it was ending. I'm gonna say it was ending. Alright. We'll see here. Laffle finishing up. Alright. We'll see here. Right. Laffle finishing up. <coughs> Sorry.
Now we have it. Now we have it. Oh, is it fixed? Oh, it sounds like it's fixed. We good? All right, super. All right, so that was EDSS versus Lethal Match for round one, I believe. So we, uh, I'm not sure if we want to take a break or not. We'll have to see, but. So EDA says brings out the first match. Well, first round, I believe. And um yeah. No one is here to tell me anything. Uh, All right. He has, he has long breaks. Mm. If you want to, you can do a five minute break. If you don't, uh, I don't. Might get the... All right, let's look going right into the next one here. So I'm going to give a countdown, and these guys are going to get ready to start. Are you still here? And you're ready to start. So, uh, both of you ready? Uh, yeah, not, I guess. Yeah, both ready. So, mm -hmm, yep. three, three, two, one, go. It looks like they are off to the races here. Now, let's see as, as we start off here. Let's see. This is first laugh of, was uh, messed with the cube at the start. No, EDSS is going to be messed with the cube at the start. Start cube is just not good for either of these players, unfortunately. But it's all going to work out here. Rifle going to 01. The assess quickly falling behind. Easy a quick, easy 01. What is about these glitches tournaments that you can't? Nothing to talk about in early games. Early games is just uh, boring. <laughs> but that's how it goes, I guess. Either way, Medios says, and Lathel finishing up a one here. We're going to see. Ooh, 
2 now. That is how numbers work. You go from 01 to 02. And we're also going to be waiting here in this door area while we wait. Oh, um, normally in these segments, I'd talk to anyone that's in the VC with me, but it's, I'm all alone, so I can tell you my day was. My day was all right. I uh, woke up like an hour ago, but uh, Lathel and EDS, I was going to grab a portal gun now. Lathel getting crossed. EDSS pre-fizzling, very nice. Hopping three into the elevator, and we're going to see our three here. Um... So uh, that portal two test, am I right? Anyways, I'm gonna see O3 here. Lathel going across O3, EDSS as well. We're gonna be on to O4 now. Um, yeah. Can you believe those mods van to be snapped in portal two? Crazy, you can't believe it. SMH. That's my world record that got invalidated, Sag. Anyways, ESS. And Lethal both jumping into the pit, I believe. And I want to see quick O4s from both of them, a very solid O4. And we're going to see. Let's see, nice O5 now. Players doing very solid O5 here. As I was doing the nice slow crawl, I do love the slow crawl, like in uh, Finale Four when there's just a minute of dialogue and there's nothing to do. Uh, 06 now, we're gonna see a nice overhead from EDSS, very clean. Let me see what Lathel does here. I thought also going to look like going to go for an overhead. And it's going to work. Very nice overhead from Lathel. We love to see the overheads. S6 overhead is a very hard strat. Not for the faint of heart. But both of our runners just nailed it out. No problem. I'm going to 07 here. And we're going to go out of 07 here, so it's already over. Both players, I assume, doing advanced. Yeah, it looks like it. It is just going into 08 now. I'm going for the block jump, jumping across. And, ooh, that's tough. Block jump claims another victim. Not fill now. Go for block up as well. Both players getting locked, block jump in the end. Now we're in 09. 09, very fun chamber. A lot of players are going to see a nice cube for a free DSS. Lathel going to grab that cube and go for a two. Oh, no, we're going to go place. And then we keep it safe in the tournament. We don't want to be messing around. Things that you're not consistent about, you just don't want to do. Okay. Both players going into 10 now. I'm going to see a six flat going into 10 for Ebes. And I feel 606. That's only six seconds behind EDSS at the moment. Which, considering the PB difference, the very nice for a laugh hole. To 11 here. Let's see, Dolphin from EDSS. Dolphin is a very hard, high-level blitzer strat, if you don't know, involving swimming in the goo to grab a portal gun. You grab the portal gun, swim in the goo, hit the button that's still in the goo, 
that at rises when you hit the portal gun and then get to the white wall and get to the end. It's a very, very hard strat, but you see EDSS just making it look like a piece of cake. Now EDSS going into 12th here. I'm seeing this low fling here. Very nice. And let's see this cube side. EDSS have this cube side memorized, yes or no? The answer is yes. EDSS is going to get that cube throw. Lathal going to be flinging up to the end here. I'm going to activate the end triggers here. Grab the cube. Let's see this low fling. Very nice low fling from Lathal. We got the same exact cube side Lathal had last half. And unfortunately, it's going to have the exact same results. That'd be a nice second try from Lathal, though. Now, EDSS can have a nice 13. Very clean, already done with 13. Lathal just going into 13 now. We're going to see 14 from EDSS, 13 from Lathal. This is the part where it gets hard for Lathal to keep up. As EDSS could just blitz out all these short, the hard advanced like later half maps with everything after 13 is just can be very very fast if you're right if they're good enough including EDSS hitting that portal uh re portal there let's see laugh EDSS going into 15 now gonna be seeing a nice first cycle probably I'm not sure if EDSS is part of the zeroth gang no it looks like EDSS is gonna be going to first for zeroth is very hard so first it's good to see in a tournament you don't want to really see Zero in the tournament because probably probably going to be too hard for most people that play the game. But EDSS has been crushing out 15. Lathal now going into 15. And we're seeing first from Lathal as well. And it looks good for first. Oh, and that's unfortunate. The bump, the uh, orb is going to bounce off the wall. But I'll lose a little bit of time for laughable, but it's still going to be fine. We go over the wall and clean out 15. Now he just says getting ready for Spider Man here in 16. What we really want to see. Let's see a quick, clean Spider Man. Look how good this Spider Man is. He just has the Spider Man down. Nothing to it. You know how it is. Making it look like. Pieces of cake. Giving it pieces of cake. You can see Lathal going into 16 now. Also going to make a piece of cake. See EDSS going into 17 here. You see some Chilino flings. We saw them for both players. So we're going to see lots of Chilino today. <laughs> see EDSS now climbing up. And do a low cube but get the nice bounce what you want to do there like ess did is you actually want to start implementing that in your runs he's using the cube to bounce the orb up bouncing the orb up means that it will be a slower bounce and it won't bounce off the walls and hit you it'll bounce off the ceiling and it won't even be close to you now we're going to see some cholino fling here unfortunately the save doesn't look too good so he just going to look pick a one here and to be a nice fling looks good and it's clear first try fling there EDSS is a solid 17, Lathal 16, solid as well. With the Lathal going into 17 now. This EDSS exit 17. Lathal for having this cube. With no low bounce, still a good bounce, but. Scary bounce, if you will. He just says getting the overhead, grabbing this uh, camera here. A second overhead. Nice door shot. We're seeing he just says go for safe. No, no, never mind. Impossible safe. Oh no, the save doesn't look like the save is good. Oh, it is good though. EDSS hits this awful save. Well, Laffel clears out 17 very cleanly, if I do say so myself. Now, Laffel, we're going to be going into 18 years. EDSS starting 19.
All right, you guys said it's gonna be seeing these peaks. Let's see it. Quick peaks. It's almost like that old montage edit with the song. Uh, oh, that's a good song. But there was a very nice old edit of the Portal Peak Strat, but it was made to look like it came out in 2007. And it had like, bring me to life over it. I think Edible made it. It was really good. Anyways, Lathel hitting the reportals. Very nice job from the reportals on Lathel ADSS going into finishing on 19 now. Ooh, a nice sniper shot from ADSS to the first try. Now ADSS could be going to EO1 with like a 12.30 on the clock. Or EO0, I mean, I apologies. See, it is us finishing up. Yo, oh, now Lathel finishing up 19. We're going through the tube here slowly. You are going to see the rival, very mysterious, mysterious individual. See the DSS. This is Flippy Skippy. Got to go for it again here. Laffle is getting nice, a nice quick uh, portal shot over there for the Fizzler. See Laffle now going for the ending shot in 19. That yeah, looks like ESS is going to be breaking the glass. Ooh, nice. Rocket shot here. You know, good to event shot. The last one's going to be entering EOO here. Yes, about to enter EO2. Hello. And we're going to have our mysterious man known as the one and only Dinos. What's up, Dinos? Hello. I'm here to shake up the commentary. Shake it up, what, yeah. What have we got going on here? EDSS versus Lathiel. Lathiel. I don't know how to pronounce it. I'm sure they're cringing when they hear us talk about it. I'm sorry. Yeah. We look like EDSS is setting up the so usual. This, yeah, the purple core here. We're going to do Ooh. the opt here. I like Lathiel's slight optimization there to save a bit of walking. It's always nice. Yeah. Is this game one? This is uh, game two. Okay. Uh, who won the first game? Uh, EESS. I Anchor see. So Star, that's their yeah. name here. Yeah. Okay. Makes sense. You can see some nice flippy skippy. Not going to work the first time. Tech times a charm, though. There we go. It's a very nice for this game from Lathel here. Lathel should practice moving in the air. It will make it a little bit easier for them to uh, be able to shoot that shot when it's a bit harder, mm -hmm. even if it's not necessarily needed. But yeah. Sometimes you get it perfect. You don't need to worry about it. Sometimes, you know, you need to move a little bit. And some people just can't, just don't know how to move. Like, I don't know how to move. If it's not in the right spot, I just won't hit it. <laughs> Probably better to just move always so that mm -hmm. you can always try. Yeah. You look like EDSS here is going for blue. Yeah, EDSS does go for oh, blue. Does fail it, unfortunately. It was for it a second time. Uh, your portal was a bit low. I don't think you're going to be able to get it. Oop. Okay. You got the re-portal this time, which helped a little bit, I think. Um, there we go. That's a nice blue. Last well, about to be entering the boss room now. And here we go. And that looks like a win for EDSS, right? Yes. Yep. We'll 16, the Is that the best of the tournament so far? That's pretty low time. It's pretty low time, but I'm not sure. I haven't been watching the entire time. Mm, fair enough. That's not quite the free night show time. Mm -hmm. 
It's the free night shirt time. Uh, somebody said yesterday, under five for first person to get under fifteen fifty six in the mm. tournament got free nitro. I forgot oh. who it was. I kind of got stolen by not having my match early. <laughs> Unfortunately, EDSS didn't get it here. Yeah, you're like the first person up. You would have stole that. And so, <laughs> yeah, that's the plan. Looks like like Lethiel is setting up the usual set set up here. It's a little bit they're a little bit far to the left here. It should work still. This looks like no op here. Okay. You should at least try one of the apps here. Uh, the op the optimization that I do here is incredibly simple. Somebody casual player could have made it. I definitely recommend it to Lathelia. But I I understand nerves could be quite hurt. Yeah, when you're at the end of this long, the longest portal one run there is. <laughs> Must count seven hour most meme categories. I guess there's not really many nerves in that. I suppose that's true. Ooh. Ooh. Gets it on the second flank. That was quite the fix. I don't think I would have been was able to a, do that in my run. Was that a PB for a row? Oh, no. Nah, unfortunately not, but very, very close. Well, congratulations. Four seconds. Then. Good job, and congratulations, EDSS, for winning the match. Uh, let's see what where the uh, bracket's going to take us next. Looks like EDSS is going to move on to face the winner of E Monkey and Lulu Zephyr, and Lethal is going to face the loser of E Monkey and Lulu Zephyr. So, we'll be one of those two. Sounds and, uh, exciting. Mm -hmm. Not gonna want to miss those. Yes, do not miss those. Mm -hmm. Like I said, I'm not sure if we want to talk to runners or if we're just gonna dip quick. I mean, uh, it was sure we can talk to EDSS or Lathiel. Yeah, they, you guys want to unmute, talk up? Let's see what's up. Yeah, because we're waiting on Zuch. No, you know, L zeros. Hello, EDSS. How you guys do? Quiet group. Mm -hmm. I'm good. Hello, Can you hear? Yep. Oh. So I only saw the last of the match, but that's pretty good time, EDSS. Is that the best time of the tournament so far? Uh, I'm not very proud of this time. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay because... for the tournament, at least. I took it very hard in some chambers. <laughs> Fair enough. Well, uh, nerves at all? Yeah, I'll, I got a lot of nerves this, this match. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Racing can be a little bit mm -hmm. uh, stress related here. Mm -hmm. What time are you guys running? What time is it for you? Uh, is that a.m. or p.m.? PM? PM. It's 5 p.m. here. Okay. Wow. So, some decent times. Good job. <laughs> Thanks. Well, I think that just about wraps up this match here. We'll see EDSS moving on to face the winner of E Monkey and Lou Zephyr. And we're going to see it. Lafayette going into the Bottom half of the bracket, not out yet though. We've seen losers runs. Uh, they'll be facing the loser of E Monkey and Lulu Zephyr, which I believe, I don't know if we have a schedule for that match yet. It doesn't look like we do yet, but we'll see, keep you updated as times come in. So, uh, yeah, thank you for being here with this match. We'll have another match in about 20 minutes, I believe. That'll be the Zuchable L0, I believe. Fabi is commentating on that one. Ooh, Fabi will be around for that. Sounds like a fun time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, yes. The Emoki versus Lula Zephyr will be 8 p.m. EST, which is about three and a half hours from now. And we're going to see 
But first, we have to do this Zuchable versus El Zero, which will be in about 20 minutes. So we'll see you guys then. Thank you guys for watching this uh, this match and the past match. We'll be back. Goodbye, folks.